Hey everyone, Ace here. What the video you are about to watch is an emotional roller coaster with lots of things going on. Shouldn't be anything too graphic. Um, I'm gonna keep tabs on that when I edit the video officially, but I just wanted to throw the segment in the very beginning just to give everybody a warning ahead of time. It is an emotional roller coaster that may or may not break the hearts of many. At least in the beginning. I will say, when you find the climax of it all, the downhill part of it is a lot better. I do promise you that. So, with that being said, enjoy the video and roll it! <laughs> Hey guys, it's you with another video, and today, it is time. I've talked about it for so long, and now it is time. So, this video is likely not coming out until after my trip, so I'm just going to give it away. I'm going to Scotland. I'm going to Scotland to visit my girlfriend, and this is going to be absolutely fucking amazing. I'm going to try to keep it short for now because I want the whole video to be filled with intervals from, say, you know, everything that happens over there and whatnot. So this video is probably going to be a lot to edit, it's going to be a lot to take on, but for the most part, it's going to be amazing! And I'm trying to be as loud as possible now, before tomorrow, because I got to get up at 2 in the morning. So to get a good night's sleep, I got to go to bed at 6 o'clock tonight, which is in about 4 hours. Less than that. So, when I wake up, I'll give my update and. Let's go! Hey everyone, so this will be update number one. It's currently, I want to say approximately six hours or less until the time when I would get up to get ready, so. I'm settling in for the night, going to bed. Um, I got my watch in the charger here. I got my phone on the charger over there. Just came back from dinner, which was go away dinner by my family. They kind of let me choose the food of my cho choosing. So I got, I said, let's have ribs and some curly fries. And I say, oh, what about a vegetable? What about a vegetable? I'm like, Eh, maybe some corn. So, then they surprise me later with some cheese to put over the curly fries. And then I said, if I want to know this was going to happen, I would have checked like broccoli or something, something that uh, the cheese would complement well with. <laughs> so, I had a good dinner. And then they made me like a little going away cake. Just a regular like chocolate cake with green frosting and sprinkles that my sister put on. It was a good night. Um, I'm hoping I had enough food to put me in a coma. <laughs> because if not, this is going to be a long ass night, let me just tell you. I already have problems with enough trying to sleep, but this would just add on to it. <laughs> just being up. Alright, so I can kind of hear it now that... I'm pretty tired, so but that definitely helps me out a lot. Makes it so I can feel secure and safe that I'm probably gonna get some good amount of sleep. You know, that would be nice. <laughs> Have that for a change. All right. You know, wishes a good night. Susan, morning. Well, morning is on. Today's the day. It's approximately 2.05 in the morning, and now I have all this stuff to do. I gotta double check things, I gotta... Well, first I gotta get myself breakfast and some coffee. I gotta start my own little 
the little coffee make I have over there that, I've, that you've probably seen before. Oh, my, I got my cat over here that's like... Woman, I am blessed to see you. Please, feed me. Meow. Commanding food. This is not gonna get... This is so really I didn't get my ass up. However, I do want to show you guys something else. So, the reason why I'm still really tired is because I spent like an extra hour worrying about my bag. So, I no longer am using the other bag. I'm taking my chance with that one because if I squish things down, it meets all the dimensions regardless what measurement you're going by for, you know, the storage space you gotta put it in. And expert travel is called the overcompensation. Let me get myself covered here. Alright, so I got breakfast started. I got my coffee being made. Got these old get my name going. If I sound a little quiet, it's because, well, like I said before, it's like 2 o'clock in the morning. I don't want to wake anybody up right now. <laughs> don't want to do that. Oh. Also, I just remembered the fact that um, I started the coffee, but I have a special monster that I brought, uh, I, I bought yesterday. That was gonna be my coffee. <laughs> oh well, I think that's um, I think that's gonna be my coffee like later. I'm gonna try to have like three cups worth today. I'm gonna use this. Green, green, green. I'm gonna use that mug today. Oh man. So, yeah. That's it, just waited. I'm gonna have my breakfast with some YouTube. Because. Ah, crap. I just short circuited the fucker. God damn it. Alright, so I'll get that situated and I'll update you back when I know more about basically anything else. I mean, not that I have to worry about that today. It just sucks. Oh man, I'm hoping that at least the main works. You are only hope, Skywalker! Okay, so, quick update, um, I have my sandwiches made, I'm hoping they're warm enough, that does in fact work, so, get on that, I'm probably just going to get me another one of those, which is going to suck, so over here in my little zone, I have some should you eat candy before a workout, food theory going. Yes, this is the kind of shit that I watch. Also, this this little sucker is up and ready to uh, entertain me to my heart's content while I'm on the plane or wherever have you. So, update is when I'm getting ready to leave and all that nonsense. Hey everybody, giving you a little update. So, breakfast was good. I enjoyed the two videos that I watched. I have my hair up just because it's going to get annoying. It's approximately 3, 14 in the morning now. Um, I think my limit is 4, but I might try to head over there a little earlier. <laughs> because it's like everybody's been talking about, you never know, you know, when things are, are going to need to be done. So, that's all the time. And I already lost my phone. Good job, man. Well, while I try to find that, the PS5 is going off for the last time for two weeks. And, um, my current feelings about the trip? Um, honestly, the same as they've been. I'm highly anxious. But I'm so highly excited. Okay, I don't know what the hell just happened. My screen went black for a second. I was honestly very concerned. <laughs> uh, so, I want to give you a heads up to this. This might end up being one of my longest videos I've done. 
at least in a while. You know what? I'm taking a hair tie out. I'm just gonna take a hat with me. The hair tie is gonna go with. I I have my cargo shorts on. I've got specific pockets that I'm gonna have with everything. I got my. Uh, even though it's really hot for right now, I got my hoodie on right now. I'm just giving you guys a little update now. Uh, man, this is going to be amazing. Uh, I'll see you guys when I have an update. I'm super anxiously excited if that's something to describe something. Hey guys, so that's me now. I made it through check through. I didn't look good, so that's, that's really good information. I kind of felt bad because I sound like such an idiot telling everybody I'm like, this is my first one, I'm supposed to do, I'm sorry. Apologize for everything, so the fact that I'm successfully able to be here right now is like majorly amazing for me. So, yeah, I can't wait to see how this goes. Um, I'm walking through the process of getting into the gates now. This is fucking amazing. It's my journey. I'm so badly right now. I'm probably going to drop my camera because it's so bad. Alright. Oh, did I go up there? Okay, so that's me finally through the gates, through the check in, and I'm now sitting by the window and watching the planes, looking at everything, this is like, I don't know if you can see this with the camera, but my hand is like so shaky right now because this is so surreal. This is like a once in a lifetime ex experience, especially for someone like me who's like, <laughs> I've never ever been on a plane before. This is like the best one thing I could ever possibly ask for. Really. And I think, yeah, I think I even made it at the right gate too, so that's like, it makes me even more happy. It's currently, I want to say it's like a couple hours until, which is like shocking. I thought I wasn't going to make it here with them like nearly enough time, but I think I gave myself just way too much time, but hey. Um, yeah, I'm starting to learn that giving yourself a lot of time is better than giving yourself like no time at all. Oh man. Alright, um. I'll either update you guys when I'm in Cancun or I'm on just the other side. The old, the ideal trip to Scotland. Oh well, guys, I finally made it to Cancun and needless to say, this is fucking horrible. My phone is only 14% with no identifiable place to charge it. I don't. I have like so much battery on my other phone to use right now. I've just. I'm so lost. I'm just so fucking lost and afraid. And I, I just, I want to get out of here. Please get me out of camp too. Hey everyone, it's me. So, um. Just updating you all on the trip and how what's going. So, as it stands, my only way out of Cancun is for my mother to take out a loan for me to finish my trip. Not even, honestly not even having a refund would save it. So I might as well just see what she can do to get me on another flight to get me over to Scotland and just try to finish this trip. I want to do something. So I did get lucky and find a phone charger station somewhere. And I could have just been hanging out all night, but it's actually a really cool crew. It's a shame I can't talk to them really because they speak Spanish and well, I don't. I just. I just wish I could come up with something to repay them, but like I said, most of my money is gone, so I'm just. <laughs> we need one to come through. And then after that, I just. I mean, I, I may be waiting here for another day. I, I may be waiting here for only half the day. Not even that. Who knows? Um, 
I'm really just playing a waiting game until somebody somewhere can do something about this. Alright, um I mean I'll either update you this when I have more or I'm finally on my trip to Scotland. And you know that'll be a happy time when I have that happen, but until that point this is my life pretty much right now. And it sucks. Suck that. But at least for what I can talk to the others, I do have financial like not financial support necessarily. I mean they are they are like ever soft and grinding snacks and kinda of helping me refill my water. This is this is just me until things change. Hey guys, so this is morning, technically three of the campaign. Um, yeah, like I, I spent two nights here or whatever. It's currently 6.5 in the morning in the American time, but in their time it's like still technically 5.30 in the morning. So I'm thinking about trying to get some, some more sleep, maybe. Um, just to, just to cover my bases. I did manage to get a flight out of here. I've only got one shot at this. So, it's a 1 o'clock flight. So, I'm going my bases. I'm going to head out of here like 8 and 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock, I guess, American time and 8 o'clock their time. Or vice versa, I suppose. So. I might try to get a little rest just to try to pass the time. Ways back a little bit. I mean, the station where it would be at, the charge my phone is kind of packed right now. I mean, I have a good amount of charge on my phones if I make it last. Especially because I need to use my main phone now. It has like 70 something percent, so. I'll be trying to use my backup phone for all that time. So, like I said, probably the best option for me to do right now is to try to sleep it off. See if I can even try to get more sleep. But this is this is gonna be a long day. I can tell it right now, this is gonna be a long day. But on the bright side, if I manage to get out of Cancun safely, securely, this is going to be an amazing trip and an amazing rest of the video. I'm happy to say with my plus strike of luck. I made it the trip. My plane hasn't boarded yet. I've been at a campaign. I guess my baby. Hey guys, what is up? I'm getting ready with my update. So I made it to Boston. <laughs> Alright, I feel like I have to do that at least once. So, yeah. Why am I back in New York? So, this is one of my connection flights before I go over to Scotland. So, there's. My plane is at E4, which I'm looking at right now, and it's not even there yet, which is good news for me. Because I think if it was, was Kaylon, it would literally say Kaylon, right? So, I'm, I'm hyped. Things are looking up now. I mean, I got, I got food in my stomach from my last flight, because they offered complimentary snacks and drinks, which I found radical. Because now I've actually got some food in my belly, I got some water for me. Um, I'm probably gonna try to go to sleep on my next flight if I can, just so I have my rest up. Because I think it's actually gonna be a long night in the next flight. I mean, I gotta double check. Yo, Easy Flight is not making it easy. No, sorry, Easy Jet is the name of the next company I'm gonna be taking. The last one before I finally arrive in Edinburgh, where I, believe, where I belong right now. Yo, this is just so surreal. The fact that. I'm exploring around different places and I'm getting to know my way around things. This is like amazing. Also, I want to give a quick shout out to everybody that, you know, came through for me one way or another. So, I'd like to thank my last flight, Delta. They helped me by, like, they didn't even realize they were helping me. Okay? <laughs> like, I mean, the time I got to that part, the, that gate, I would have just made it there, right? But now it's at the point where I'm literally thinking, I'm like, yo, 
I that was like in itself a sort of lightsaber. But of course, close to that, time to go to the real thinkers. So I'd like to make two huge shoutouts. Well, technically three or four huge shoutouts, but the two biggest shoutouts are to my girlfriend and her family. That's one. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have known that the flight was still there. I thought it had, like, already left when it got there. No. I was just at the wrong motherfucking place. <laughs> I was just at the wrong place. I wasn't... I didn't even go and find the place where the Delta flight was. <laughs> so, in a way, that was on my part. Especially because, you know, like I said, I didn't realize it, and I was... I think I was just in the mentality of, like, I was so broken, and I just kind of, like, wanted to lay down and cry. I ended up going back to the other terminal that I was taking refuge at, let's say. That was a crazy business. I'm not even going to get into all of that. <laughs> so, then we have my mother, I had to think. She was the one that, like, if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't even have this secondary option. I would I would have been probably suffocating to the same to die. My girlfriend's family was trying to look into it though. They were heavily trying to look into it, but my mother literally took out a loan just for me to come in Cancun. Which I gotta spit some shit, right? Cancun City? Specifically Cancun City. Not Cancun itself. From what I can tell it's Cancun itself, it's nice. Cancun City. There's so much fucked up with that place, especially that individual airport. Yo, that airport was a pain in the ass. Very, very little plugs to plug your charger in that, and so on and so forth. Like, it's just, again, it's just so surreal, and I'm just, I'm happy that hell is over. I am, I'm extremely happy that hell is over. You have no idea. So, that's going to be my update for this time. More to come when I'm in Amsterdam and then in Scotland. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? So, I just had to try to complain and read the flight. Essentially, I, I got it for free. Right? I got it for free, but I essentially had to read the flight for late tomorrow, so. That's five hundred dollars down the drain that my girlfriend's family had put out for a hotel for me and her, which is not refundable. So, I mean, obviously it could be worse. I could be spending another night in Cancun. Whereas here, I have the place as well as the outlet all to myself, and I can get drinkable water anytime I want to. So, that's an upside right there at least, and there's these comfy chairs that I can kind of like push myself up in, or, you know, try to, try to put my jacket over me, like a blanket, so yeah, so that's, um, that's the fun time I'm having right now, and it's to the point where my girlfriend's even, like, pissed off about it, and I really can't blame her, I can't blame her because even I'm, like, super pissed off about it right now, so just to think, basically, one more sleep until... I can hopefully end this bullshit. I do have a flight that's got me covered. I think in for Amsterdam, I gotta check the ticket again. I'll look at that before I go to bed tonight. I promised myself I would. It's it's been a long, stressful journey for everybody. I've I've definitely got some reviews to make. I've got some trust issues to sort of help. And at this point, I don't I don't care about any hotel or anything. I just I just want my baby girl at this point. I just I just want to be in her bed, cuddling with her. Just, that's it. <sighs> well, I'm going to finish some bullshit up and try to see if I can have a rest for the night. So guys, in the morning when I try this bullshit all over again. <sighs> well guys, we did it. <laughs> With the help of many people along the way, we fucking did it.
Let's just say about this too, then. Of course, you guys won't see anything. I'll see everything. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get enough of that. <laughs> As I continue to do it. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, so many people want to thank for this, but... But, um... <laughs> the whole other thing about it. Seriously. So... Yeah, so many people to thank. But primarily, I... I wouldn't even be able to afford... the tickets to come over here without... Sarah and her family. They are absolutely godsend. The best I could ever ask for. So, and of course, you can't go without saying mom helps too. Or she could. RIP to her anxiety though. Well, mom worried about her only son and all that. But, um, yeah, I went to Amsterdam. I technically wasn't registered for that flight. That pissed me off. <laughs> and then Sarah's family helped me out increasingly to get back to where I need to be over here. So that is just absolutely everything I could ever ask for. Because my first thought rolling in here was this is just fucking incredible. I love absolutely all of this. This is literally a dream come true. And if you look over there, I'm going to try to... She got me a nice little display of items over there that I may or may not film me trying. So there's the update on that. The rest of this video I am happy to say it's going to be nothing but pure positivity. 100%. Yeah. So we got back from day two of officially enjoying the fucking vacation. And I. Well, we went over the shop, right? And we came back with quite the haul. So I can't wait to show this off. Hopefully, I don't cut off the recording like this. So, first up, we have Legos. So, hers is there. We did have a third one, but that was her brother, so he took it away. <laughs> this is mine. How much? You can't even fucking see that. So, hers is kind of like <laughs> hiding right there. We go. I know it's not very clear, but you can kind of see it. So, front and back of our Legos. This comic that actually just recently came out, like, what was it today? Oh, like yesterday. So, that is gonna be one hell of a nice read. This Iron Bro, some actual fucking Iron Bro, not fucking the shit they, they gave me on the skates. Get out of here with that shit. Ha! Six men. So we got Young Hellboy. I cannot wait to see this. I am a fan of Hellboy. And so, seeing his son is like... Amazing. <laughs> no way to put it, amazing. Next, Star Wars Bounty Hunters, oh my god. Guys, if you guys have known me long enough, you'll know I'm a big fan of not just Star Wars, but Bounty Hunters. So like, this is amazing. Also, I never realized this before, but this guy has a Dominator vibe to him. <laughs> just a little bit. And, lastly, we have what I'm assuming is like, I mean, I'm telling you, it's like either super hard plastic or it's 
a metal Dungeons and Dragons playing cards thing. I cannot wait to open this thing. Unfortunately, I'm not going to unbox it here. I'm gonna have fun with it on my own. And as a bonus, my first British currency, Bradash. You know, fucking car. Upper Cobra, which is. <laughs> so that's the update for today. Can't wait for more. So we're at not the final part, I mean our fun of just sleeping, but we're at like a later part of day three of just finally enjoying myself. And today <laughs> That's okay. And we've been kinda of just staying in the whole night. Oh. oh my god, she's hot! Hello. So beautiful. I'm so lucky. So I've kind of been staying in today. I thought it was a butt. But it's like a lot I finally managed to get her PS4 working and she got a new TV that I hooked up for her. I gotta figure out what's going on with her three a little bit later. Maybe tomorrow. I need I, I, I need tools though. I can't do nothing with tools. This is quality content you guys are getting right now. So, in case you're wondering, here is her channel. She, yes, she has an official channel. As, as you can see, she already has a gameplay from possibly her favorite game. And she is going to be working on more in the future. So I highly recommend you check her out. Link should be in the description below. If not, well, I'll <laughs> leave this link up here. You can try to find it yourself. Or, of course, you can just type in her name or her at into the search bar like so just do that copy of course using whatever device you have paste enter okay don't know why it's not coming up properly hold on huh. maybe if i do there we go so for those of you on computer you got to spe specify in youtube I wonder, can you even, you can probably go into the search bar and type in channel, it might even work then, or be a complete asshole, whatever. <laughs> you should also be able to just type in this, no? Yeah, so that, that part of it works. So, just highly recommend checking out her channel. Not just because she is my fiance, but because she is just plain amazing and she does put some heart into her videos. So yeah, that's enough from current me. Back to the video. You guys are getting right now. Your mom works. Look at stop. Don't know what that's called. Big move. Maybe not. Oh. Bye, bitch. Yeah. 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 Good boy. We're, we're, big, but your brain's small. Now that we have this, <laughs> now that we have this, we're probably just gonna be fucking around the whole night. It's probably gonna be up pretty late, to be honest. Gonna be doing plenty of snacking as well. He just punched her in the crotch. Damn. <sighs> On a serious note, I I am really happy right now. Like so fucking happy right now. And I feel like my vacation's only beginning. Well, technically it is. Technically it is. I have a total twenty fifth. That's a little, little over a week left. But it, it actually almost feels like two weeks. To be honest. <laughs> All right. Well, once again, update you guys when I have more. Um, I can't get up now. <laughs> I'm too, I'm, I'm hurting too much to get. He's mine. He's
I love her with it. I'm sorry with my So tomorrow we're going out to the museum, so you probably won't hear from us until later in the day, but I think at this point, this is how I'm working it, where at the end of every day I'll try to give like a brief little scenario with no, no longer than five minutes if I can help it. Yeah, you never offered to put me in it, so... You never want to be. Michelle, you could ask. Nah, <laughs> Listen, COVID hit me rough for you guys, okay? I'm a bit of a mess. Anyway. Anyway. So, that's Moscow right now. We're just going to be relaxing with each other. We're going to show the company. Of course, I don't put more of a right now. I want to see another museum tomorrow. Up to is tomorrow night. Bye, bitches. Hey guys, back with an update. So, I forgot to vlog yesterday. I got Sarah involved in Warframe. So, you know, that's how we've been going. We were up a little bit later last night. Just relaxing. The museum was really fucking fun. I did get a couple souvenirs. Um, one I'm definitely going to make use of. Another is... Probably gonna end up breaking them all on me, but I don't care. <laughs> uh, today we've just been basically having a chill day. You know, I've been showing her more Warframe. We've been watching Mirai and Nikki all day, <laughs> which is an anime in case some of you don't know. It's actually a really cool, real, a really fun, but really fucked up anime. Uh, so. We're playing tomorrow, we're gonna go see Leaf, I'll maybe remember how to update you on that. I know that I'm not necessarily losing track of my days, but I'm just forgetting to update you because I'm just having such a great time. But that's that's the situation so far. Um, we're probably gonna blow out the rest of the series tonight before we go to bed. So It'll be my third official series that I finished. Uh, yeah. It's gonna be fucking amazing. This, this has been great. I've been enjoying my time. And Scotland is amazing. Alright, I'll beat you more later. So, this is night, whatever it is. Like I said, I, I started forgetting my day uh, in a good way. In a good way, it's been, it's been nice. So, we did do that thing I was talking about. I fucking forgot about it now. Life has just been such a day that it's like I'm living a dream. So, yesterday, because again, I forgot to update. For a day, so uh, oops. Yesterday, we um, we actually got Sarah's favorite fucking game for her fourth Tekken, just Tekken Seven. And so we basically been doing that throughout last night, a lot of last night, and um, some of today. She's currently on a fight now, actually. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> so and then today, today I want to stop mucking about, we went to the pool. It is, I didn't even realize, it has been such a long time since I've been in the pool. Fucking. When I first got in, it's like I forgot how to swim, uh, and then my body, like, my body like, remembered instantly. It is, it is really nice though. 
Especially when I got to that time of night where the pool was starting to close. And so there was only like 10 people left in the book. It, it did feel really nice. Not to mention, um, I was getting back in the swing with, uh, let's just say, swim shorts that weren't the best for me. <laughs> I don't care, I said. <laughs> I told them to get speedos. Uh, and you they know what? And you know what? Lesson is learned. I'm gonna start going speed up. You thought I was being a person. Well, you know what, dude. So let's get through for the night. Again, hoping I don't forget to do updates for the next couple of days. I probably will, so. I'll probably just give the plans now just to do these an update, so. Oh, no, it's out. American guy, never mind. So tomorrow we're finally going to be, well, I'm finally going to be meeting her granddad. I've only wanted to meet that man ever since I fucking heard him. He sounds like a really great guy. And I'm hoping everything goes well. Uh, and then the next day, there's a chance that we're going to go see Glasgow. If not, then it's just going to be another day where we just settle in, maybe. Have another day of rest. But Saturday. Saturday, we're going to have um, this double date thing going that I think I'm going to go pretty well. I ain't been on my toy. I told you so much. No, it's probably just our reason. No, no. You're in the car with your son. I'm going to help. I'm not sick. I don't feel sick. Anyway, it's also, <laughs> so I'm already coming up to the five, my five minute mark for this clip, so I'm gonna cut it off here. Like I said, update is when I have more. Just gonna keep that on my baby. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's all for this time. So that's gonna wrap up. Um, another night. So, this has been two days of the Zinger and that, and it has been, wow, amazing. He is such an awesome character. American Friends one of the fucking friends, though. So, Sarah doesn't know this yet, but I'm going to ask her to marry me tomorrow. <laughs> So, tomorrow we're going out on a double date with two of Sarah's friends. Well, Sarah's friend and her, um, her boyfriend. And I'm going to take them to pop the question. Wait, I got the ring right in my bag. I'm thinking about it. I don't know exactly when it'll be tomorrow, but I'm definitely going to do it tomorrow. Considering, especially because... Tomorrow is the last official day I have in Scotland. I'm pretty sad about it, to be honest. I've been enjoying my time here. It's been fucking amazing. So, just gonna wrap that up. Um, I might be able to let you know what's up at the end of tomorrow. Or I might be too busy arranging things for, you know, the trip home and all that. Uh, worst case scenario, I'll just update you this one. You know, when the newest thing happens or whatever. Check you guys out. Hey guys, I'm back now. At, um, I don't exactly want to say home anymore. Home to me anymore is where Sarah is. You know, I guess you could say back in America. <laughs> um, I just got off the phone with Sarah. Um, I'm apparently waiting on dinner to come soon. I'm gonna have a shower. I'm gonna take care of my fucking shaving problem here. I'm getting fucking scruffy. <sighs> my
my current mental status is not great at all. Um, I'm currently, I'm somewhere currently in between, let me sleep, I need to relax, I need to handle the situation with making it so I can move over there, and my mind is just like mixed up with a lot of different things, and I think I'm going to pass out just because of how much I'm exhausting myself right now. But, I'll definitely say, um, I'm swearing on Pop-Up Clinton's grave, but I'm going to work on getting over there, whatever I can do to help with it. I'm going to. Even if it's just something as stupidly simple as, fuck it, pick up and go. Just... Just pick up and go. Which is something, granted, I don't want to have to do, but... I can't help it, I'm just... Ever since I left, I don't feel happy. And, like, I did things on the flight that... Would make me happy, like, I... I listened to some rock music, I fucking... I watched the movie I've been meaning to watch, Guardians of the, Guardians of the Galaxy 2, I... I'm doing all these things and nothing's making me happy. I just, I just need that woman again. I just need to be with her again. At least I know what I can do now and what I need to do now. Things are becoming very clear to me now. But um, yeah, that's gonna be it from me for this time, guys. Uh, I hope you managed to enjoy this video for what it was. I'm sorry it wasn't so much sightseeing as well as anything else. Like, comment, subscribe, and as always, I'll see you all in the next video or live stream. Can't mind, Jimmy Pods.